If you've been on TikTok or any social media, you know that there's always some weird trends that just come out of nowhere. Whether those trends are taking on the cinnamon challenge, going to Chuck E. Cheese's at 3 a.m., or some horrible dance, they all come and go. They're called trends for a reason. It's trending for a short period of time, and then we just throw it away. Usually when these random trends come out of nowhere, I never take part in them, just because they're random, and I usually just watch other people do it, and I'm like, okay, cool, that's stupid, I'm not gonna take part. But there's this new trend that has taken over TikTok, at least on my For You page. Maybe you've seen it on YouTube. This trend consists of filling a bottle with corn syrup and then adding some type of sweetener, whether that be a soda or Kool-Aid, letting it freeze, squeezing it, and then biting into it. Ah! Pure corn syrup, a delicious treat. The funny thing about this trend is people are just biting into corn syrup and they're like, yummy, yummy, it's delicious. Today, let's make a simple one. You're gonna need some bottle cap candy. We're gonna use this one specifically. Dark corn syrup and some silver sugar sprinkles. Let's grind up the candy. Add the syrup, silver sprinkles. Now your bottle. Now fill the rest of it with more syrup. Freeze it. Okay, four hours later. The average person shouldn't eat straight up corn syrup. That's horrible for you. Corn syrup isn't a treat, but hey, do what you wanna do. About a week later on my For You page, I saw a new trend which was somewhat more doable for me. This trend consisted of filling a bottle with honey, freezing the honey, then squeezing the bottle, and you bite the honey. Testing the frozen honey trend. Let's see how it tastes. Pushing it out. Wow, oh my. Taste test. This is the world we live in. These are trends. The trend consisted of filling an empty bottle of water with honey, freezing the bottle of honey, and later on, take it out of the freezer, squeeze it, as a turd of honey comes out of the bottle and you bite into it. That's what trends are nowadays. If you aren't in the loop of social media, consider yourself lucky. People have been begging me, Brent, you need to do the honey trend. You need to put honey in a bottle, bite into it, see if it actually works. So I've got honey and I've got a bottle of water. I need to drink the bottle of water before I can put the honey in. Let me show you the time right now. 12.46 a.m. I leave for Vegas in a few hours. While you're watching this, I'm probably on a plane to Vegas. I'm committed to make videos for you all, even if it's at 1 a.m. Supposedly, according to this article online, eating frozen honey can upset your stomach. You may experience bloating, stomach cramping, diarrhea. Wonderful. I don't get it though. You can eat normal honey and you're fine, but if you eat frozen honey, you're like, <laughs> I'm here to test out a TikTok trend so you don't have to. But hey, maybe this will be a new series of mine, trying TikTok slash YouTube trends so you don't have to. Comment some weird trends down below that you want me to try out. If your comment gets a lot of likes, I'll probably do it. Speaking of likes, if you're ready for this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much, I appreciate it. So what probably is gonna happen, since it's 1 a.m., I'm gonna fill this with honey, throw it in the freezer, go to sleep for like four hours, wake up around 7.30, come down here, film me biting into this honey first thing in the morning. So that'll be kinda interesting. Uh, so step one is we gotta drink this water because we gotta put honey in this bottle. I see a lot of people do it with the smaller bottles, so we'll see what happens. I don't know, I, I, like I said, I'm not a big trend person. I think that was a world record time for the fastest bottle of water to ever be drunken. Drinking. Why can't I speak? Step two, grab your honey. This is the most generic honey. Essential everyday honey. Let's go ahead and fill this bottle with honey. This is the dumbest, dumbest trend. Looks like Winnie the Pooh peeing into a bottle. That's me after a Taco Bell Crunchwrap Supreme. I'm going to freeze it like this. Let's go ahead and let that fall for a few minutes. So while we're waiting for the honey to go all the way to the top, subscribe. This is such a stupid trend. Why am I doing this at 1 a.m.? I've got this pitcher of ice. What we're gonna do now is we're just gonna go ahead and we're gonna... Now let's go ahead and put this in the freezer. Come on! There's SpongeBob popsicles in there. I wasn't lying when I told you I had SpongeBob popsicles. But there's a catch. These are all the open ones from that one video. I told you I never waste them. Let's put it right there. We'll have frozen honey poo in no time. Goodbye, honey. I'll miss you. Hey, look, it's Brent with a walkie-talkie. Okay, so now the fun part. We gotta wait like three hours for that to harden. But yeah, since it's 1 a.m., I'm probably gonna go to bed and then I'll wake up in the morning and then I'll bite into the honey so you all can watch me suffer. I don't think it's gonna be that bad. I don't even know why this is a trend. I think it's just such a dumb trend. Like, trends are so stupid. I will see you all in a few hours with the hopefully frozen honey. Sweet dreams.
Well, it's 8.34 in the morning. See, there's daylight. Let's go see what the honey looks like. There's our honey. I have absolutely no desire to squeeze this and bite into it. Why is this a trend? Why? Why is this a, why is this a thing? I guess what I do now is take the cap off and just squeeze this and bite into it. It better be delicious. This will literally be the first thing I've eaten today. What a great way to start your day. Wake up, take a frozen bottle of honey out of the freezer, squeezer, and mmm. I do not want to do this at all. We got to go head in. <laughs> it literally looks like honey poo. Ugh, it's lots of effort. Okay, I guess what I do now is I'm supposed to bite it and I'm not looking forward to it, so here we go. Hopefully it's delicious. Ugh. Oh my God. If you've ever had honey before, it tastes literally like honey. So much so. I mean, honey's good, but like, this is like, Uh-uh. Nope. Ugh. Ugh. I'm gonna put it back in the bottle. What is the point of this trend? You freeze honey, and then you just... Literally, it's the... Ugh. I feel like I'm gonna throw up. <coughs> Don't do it. It's just so dumb. It's such a stupid thing to do. I literally can't tell you what's satisfying about that. There was not one thing satisfying about that. It just tastes like frozen honey. That's what it is. I wasted a good eight hours of my energy for this video to squeeze a bottle of frozen honey and So that's what trends are nowadays. Freezing honey and biting into it. Wow, we got some creative minds out there. So as I said previously, if you see any YouTube or TikTok trends, Comment them down below, and if you get a lot of likes on your comment, I'll probably try it. I think I read last night that it says that can hurt your stomach, and my stomach is feeling weird. Probably because the average person shouldn't eat that much honey. Like, the amount of honey I had in one bite, like, that's a lot of honey. The funny thing is, is today I leave for Las Vegas, so as you're watching this, I'll be in the airport. Hopefully I get it uploaded with that airport Wi-Fi. Well, yeah, that's the frozen honey trend. Not that great. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Go ahead, do it. Hey, you just disliked it. I'm there you go. If you're new to the channel, you like what you saw, feel free to subscribe. We hit 1.4 million. Thank you so much. Road to 1.5 million. For merch, stickers, other stuff like that, www.brenttelevision.com. Follow my Instagram, at Brent Television. I'm almost at 30,000 followers on there. If you're bored and you want to see some funny photos, at Brent Television on Instagram. And well, I got to go ahead and pack because I didn't do that yet. So thank you all so much for watching. I will see you all in the next video. Bye, everyone. Hey, so I'm currently editing this video right now and I saw that after I ate the honey, it was stuck in my beard for the rest of the video. That's disgusting and I just want to apologize for that because I didn't notice. Brent TV, Brent TV, Brent TV has a video for me. Yeah. Brent TV, Brent TV, Brent TV has a video for me. Oh, now he's opening up.